how would you describe your character Kunal? Uh, so Kunal is someone. Uh, he he's uh, uh, he he's he's in his teens. Uh, he's head over heels for for this girl, uh, which which is an understatement actually. He's he's like he's out and out in love with this girl. I'm uh, madly in love with this girl, and uh, he's someone who you know uh, he he speaks his mind. He doesn't you know he doesn't filter words with with his friends and with people. He's himself, and uh, especially with Tara, uh, his love. And the show is about that only that you know he uh, to what extent he goes for Tara and uh, how he gets betrayed, but yet you know he's still doing uh, uh, everything for her. and uh, how he gets screwed in life because of that and uh, all of that so it's a journey right. of that character from point a to point b right so uh, we are getting sort of a kabir singh vibes from the character uh, would you say yeah. he's like kabir singh with a touch of humor um no yeah i, I think uh, it's fair for you guys to feel that uh, it's similar to kabir singh because kabir singh was such a huge hit and because of the brilliant performance by shahid kapoor uh but no yeah i mean it's 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 a completely different world uh, uh and to be honest like the story was written uh, so the story is based on a book and it's it's based on true events it's based on the writer's life story so ko mr kunal marathe and uh, the book that he wrote he wrote it way back i think uh, way way before kabir singh or arjun reddy uh, came up so so yeah so i mean and it's i mean the crux is the same uh, the obsession the love and everything but uh, it's there are two separate characters two separate journeys uh, kabir was kabir had anger issues and uh, um, you know um, he was a little eccentric and it was different he was a successful surgeon this guy is is a teenager he's in his college he's figuring out life he's in love with this girl and uh, you know he's just a normal teenager from indore who's coming to mumbai to you know achieve his dreams and uh, yeah so yeah i mean it's two different journeys what made you pick the project was it the script was it the director what was it? uh the script first the story actually uh because i couldn't believe what this i what i just read because uh, there's so much happening in just one script you know this guy uh, from being a college boy to uh, moving to mumbai to getting betrayed to uh, drinking to going back to fighting to doing everything uh for this one girl and uh, uh realizing that it's based on a true story i really wanted to meet the person who did all this and uh, and the character man i mean uh, uh with this character it's it's once in a lifetime opportunity it's got everything it's got action drama romance uh emotions uh, so it, it was a good opportunity for me to explore my capabilities and you know try something new right yeah um- So many people might not exactly remember that you were a part of Dangal. Could you say that that uh, film changed your, uh, you know, career? It just uh, gave you a kickstart to your career. Could you say yes, that? Yes, yes, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. It was a big uh, because I, I, and I believe for all of us, like uh, the whole cast of all all the young uh, people in the show uh, in the movie, I feel it did great things to us, and uh, we're very fortunate that we got to be a part of such a uh, big film. and uh, i got a lot of work posts that i got a lot of good work posts that and yeah so it it did great things for us okay um so tell me about your experience working with vedika and ashay uh, vedika and ashay ashay, ashay. oh, oh yeah ashay ashay it yeah. was a blast shine it was a blast <laughs> i they one of the nicest co actors and they're so much fun to be around and it was once after the pack up we used to go out chill have dinner uh chill in each other's rooms and um, vedik and i we only shot in indore and some parts in bombay but ashish and i was like there through and through in bombay like yeah. so i spent a lot of time with him he is like a brother to me he is he's a sweetheart so yeah which is what i was coming to next because you guys play best friends and i'm pretty sure he would have a very big role in yeah yeah, yeah 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 he is so, no he's a <laughs> so sweetheart that yeah. translates into real life as well absolutely so i was down with covid uh, a month ago and uh, i was recovering and uh, this guy posted a story about some cake or something ashay okay. and i and i replied to it are wow yeah what a cake nice you're having fun and all that and the next day i received the same cake in my mail and he's like you know this is for Aww. you you know Aww. like so yeah and on set also used to get me you, he makes amazing mutton and all that so used to get me mutton uh, he made uh, sweets for the whole set 
and he he's a like he's all heart lovely yeah. chap and a brilliant actor yeah, yeah. all them even vedika all of these guys dheer yeah okay and tell me about your experience with samit kakkar i think it's your first time working with him right yeah it was the first time working with him brilliant yeah. oh top guy top guy i mean he's so technically sound he knows what he wants uh, no take is wasted and he doesn't use a monitor yaar he doesn't use a monitor on set he what? yeah he just sees the scene like with his eyes he doesn't see the monitor only oh, so initially yeah. it was like are sir aap monitor to dekho kuch bhi pata nahi nahi mereko malum hai na i'm seeing it here what yeah. will i miss and yeah. it works man it it's crazy how he does it and he's hilarious he, like it's a blast on his side he loves everyone and keeps on cracking jokes mast maza aata hai so i had a <laughs> blast talking with him yeah tell me about one of your most memorable uh, moments from, from the set memorable moments i think uh, one was so we had a very grueling shoot we were shooting non stop at this rockyard and it was it was a very tough time like we were shooting 9 days non stop 14 15 hours a day uh, so it had really gotten to us and uh, we had a night shoot the next day at marine lines and it was my dream to shoot at marine lines and it was me and myself and ashay and we were there and it was all like you know it was uh, much chill scenes the sare koi rona dona nahi kuch nahi so we had a blast we were chilling sitting at marine lines drinking coffee uh, talking to each other we had a, we had we had some good conversations that night and yeah. ordered ordered some good food from uh, town and like you know it was amazing 